Simply use any video you want and drag it onto the timeline. Then use another video and put it above the main video. Now double click on the second video and go to its compositing. Now select any compositing for blending the clips together. Here you can see that my main video is now in double exposure with the second video. If I change the compositing type then now the two videos are overlaying each other instead of being in a double exposure. So the idea behind a double exposure or a blend exposure is to make two clips blend together so that they form a unity. Like in this type of blend exposure, I'm trying to make the video as black and white as possible so that later on when I'm gonna try the double exposure in it, it will look better. Because creating a double exposure with a black and white image and video is actually much easier as compared to a colored video or image. Okay, so let's just say that if I were to use two colored videos or images together, then you can notice that these are overlaying each other and not forming a good unity. Hence the double exposure becomes hard to create in this case. So I hope that you kind of understood that double exposure is all about blending two images or videos together to form a unity instead of overlaying one video on top of another because that is not known as double exposure. And that is why it is preferred to use a black and white gamut in it. So guys, what are your thoughts on this video? Let me know in the comment section below. And if you think that this video is worthwhile, then hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that I can able to bring amazing videos just like this for you. Till then, see you later.